Hello friends, my name is Tushar and today I am going to discuss the question search in binary search tree. So what is a binary search tree? A binary search tree is a regular binary tree with additional constraint that left child is less than parent and right child is greater than parent. And this is true recursively for every node. So this is an example of a binary search tree. Here 10 is greater than everything on its left side and is less than everything on its right side. Again minus 5 is greater than everything on its left side and less than everything on its right side. And this is true for every node. Here, this is also an example of a binary search tree where 10 is less than everything on its right side, 15 is less than everything on its right side, and so on. So how do we search in a binary search tree? Let's see how this works. So if I'm searching for key 0, I start from the root node. I know that 0, first I compare if the root node value is same as 0. It's not. So I know that 0 is less than 10, so we go on the left side of 10, so we reach here. Again, we check if the node value at uh, the root node is same as zero, it's not. So now zero is greater than the value here, so we go on the right side, since it's a binary search tree. Again, we check if zero's node's value is same as key, this time it is. So we return this node, this particular node. Let's see how we search for key 36. Again, we start from 10. We say, we see that key is not same as 10. So we check that 36 is greater than 10, so we come here. Now here, again, 30 is not same as 36, and also 36 is greater than 30, so we go on the right again. And this time, 36 is same as 36, so we turn this uh, particular node. Let's try for key 18 in this tree. So here, 10, again, 18 is not same as 10, also 18 is greater than 10, so we go on the right, 15. 18 is not same as 15, and it's greater than 15, so we go on right. Again, 16 is not same as 18, so we go on right. And this time they are same, so we return this particular node. How much time does it take to search in a binary search tree? In the worst case, it takes of n time to search in a binary search tree. Like searching in this tree, the worst case was of n because we looked at every element before we found the bin before we found the node we were looking for. If a binary search tree is balanced, like this binary search tree, the worst case time can become log n. So for balanced binary tree. For balanced binary search tree, its searching is O of log of n. And for regular binary search tree, searching is O of n. Next, let's look at the code of uh, searching into binary search tree. All right, let's look at the code of binary searching into binary search tree. Let's look at the general structure of the code. The name of the function is search. It takes the root of the binary search tree and the key we are looking for. It will return the node if the key is found or it will return null if the key is not found in the binary search tree. So let's, let's look at the code. If the root is null, it returns null. If the root data is same as key, it returns root. Otherwise, it goes left or right depending on if root data is less than or greater than key. Let's try with this example here. My key is 5, my root is 10 initially. So we go into this code, root is not null. Root data is not same as key. Here, root data is not less than key because 10 is not less than 5. So we go into search root left. So we go here. So my new root, if we go here. So my root new root is minus 5. The key I'm looking for is still 5. Again, root is not null. Root data is not same as key. Uh, root data this time is less than key. So we go on the right side. So 5's right. So 5. So again, root is 5, 5 is not null. This time, root data is same as key. So we return this particular node up to the calling function. So this gets returned here, and this gets returned here, and 5 gets returned to the calling function. Now let's look for how, let's look at example 22. What happens when we search 22 in this uh, BST? So my root is again 10, and I'm searching for key 22. Uh, root is 10, root is not null, root data is not same as key, root data is less than key, true, so we go on roots right, so root is 25 now, because 10's right is 25, and the key is again 22, again root is not null, root data is not same as key, root data is not less than key, so we search root left, so we go into uh, 25's left, 25's left is null, so this becomes null here, and the key we are searching for is 22. Again, 
if you come here root is null this time so this guy returns null so null gets returned to the this guy's calling function and this returns null and finally null is returned to the calling function so if the key existed it returned 5 if the key did not exist like 22 it returned null if you want the full code for this problem go to my github link github.com mission piece interview wiki and if you want to check out similar questions go to my youtube channel youtube.com user to shorewrite 2525 thanks for watching this video